Who knew such an amazing book could lead to such great stories with such great meaning? Well, this book has. Hello everyone, my name is Yusuf Ahmed and welcome to another book song. The Five People We Meet in Heaven is a great story that features a main character called Eddie. Eddie sadly dies from a tragic accident that happened when he was trying to save little girl from falling off the carts, but it ended up that the cart fell on Eddie, but the little girl eventually survived. Each person has a story to tell Eddie. For example, the first person was a blue man. He taught Eddie that all lives are connected together. And the quote with this is at page 52 that he says, No life is a waste. The only time we waste is the time we spend thinking we are alone. Remember that bus ride you took that you said thank you or you just smiled at the bus driver, who in this case is the stranger? If it wasn't for that bus driver, you wouldn't be able to go to your destination. So he is saying that all, all people are connected together and they all helped us with anything that we need. The second person is a captain in war, and Eddie went to war. So this captain, he teaches Eddie in page 98 how to sacrifice is vital in life. And the quote that's with that is, that's the thing, sometimes when you sacrifice something precious, you're not really losing it, you're just passing it on to someone else. Sacrifice doesn't have to be something like giving up your life for someone. It can be as small as taking your time to stop and smile at someone. And what you're sacrificing is your time on earth to help comfort someone. A woman called Ruby teaches Eddie the lesson of forgiveness. And the quote to that is at page 130, which she says, Things that happen before you are born still affect you, she said, and people who come before your time affect you as well. I remember when we had a little mini quiz that we were working on, and there was a there was a prize for first place, and I was in the lead. I got a question wrong. This person got it right, and they decided to cheat off me every single question, and I kept getting the right answer, and since they kept cheating off of me, they would get the right answer as well. They got first place, and I immediately figured out that they were cheating. So I was immediately headed to the teacher, and then I realized, this is not going to help me in life. If I just tell on this person, what will this prize do to me? I can always forgive no matter what. And I forgave him, and I felt so much better to get all of that out of my chest. The fourth person Eddie meets is his wife, Margaret. She teaches Eddie the lesson of love and how love exceeds over death. She tells Eddie at page 148, lost love is still love. Life ends, but love doesn't. And I find that really strong. We all have that one person we consider a friend or a close friend. Like for example, there were these three friends in Bahrain that I really loved and I truly made lots of memories with them and apparently I had to go to more advanced school and I had to leave them there but see even though we were far apart we still loved each other and that's the most important thing we travel to see them again lost love can still be loved we can still find them together the fifth and final person is a really sad one. Going back to the captain's lesson, when Eddie was in war with the captain, Eddie fired a gun which created a fire at a hut. The only thing is, he thought that he saw a figure inside the hut. And actually, there was a figure. But his friends were like, no, no, come on, we have to go. And they really did. But he saw a figure inside and he was panicking. And then he thought that his mind was just playing tricks on him. But there was a figure, and it was a little girl, and the fire burned the girl. So then in heaven, she came back and told him the story. And Eddie said, oh, there was a figure there. The little girl named Tala, and she was very kind about it. But she just told Eddie the true story, which I found really admiring. And at page 208, which is the final page of the book, it states, Each affects the other, and the other affects the next. And the world is full of stories, but the stories are all in one. What a beautiful way to end a beautiful book, don't you think? Thank you so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe. And of course, hit that notification bell to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video.